Welcome to the Midweek Refuel with Lupus in Color, where we strive to educate, inspire, encourage, and empower lupus warriors all around the world. Today, I was asked a question. Actually, it, I was given a statement, and it was from a young lupus warrior, and she said that she just feels stuck, and she feels like her life is over since she's been diagnosed with lupus, and how hard it was to really deal with the issues that come with lupus and a new normal. So I wanted to address it a little bit in the midweek refuel today, um, just about understanding how important it is to really go through those feelings so that you can come out on the other side of being, being, I don't even want to say happy. Be I'm sorry, you can hear my dog snore. Sorry. Being okay with a new normal. Um, I think a lot of us want to have what we had pre-diagnosis, and that's understandable. But the reality is, is that we are never going to get that. We're never going to get those years back. It's just like life itself, you know, when we get older, we want to be younger. Um, when we're younger, we want to be older. We're always going to pine for who we were before diagnosis. And there's nothing wrong with that. But the reality is, is that we have to get to a point where we see who we were and then we learn to adapt and change to be what we are today and begin to accept whatever limitations we might have so that we can build, adapt, and get to a normal that is sufficient for the body we have now. So it can be very difficult to move from being so sad that you have to deal with lupus and that lupus is in your life. But after we go through those feelings, we have to get to a point of action. We have to get to a point of action where we can really stop and say, you know what? The person I used to be was amazing, but the person I am today is even stronger and better than I can ever imagine considering the things that I'm going through. And I'm not telling you to just, you know, oh, it is what it is. I'm not who I am. No, go through those feelings. Allow yourself to feel them. Allow yourself to pine for them. And then make a plan to adapt and change into what you are today so that you can live and you can have somewhat of a normal life beyond lupus. We cannot continue to wish for what we used to be because when we stay in the past, we're not able to see what's right in front of us. We're not able to understand that we have overcome so many things. And today we are stronger than we ever thought we could be. And we need to live in that moment. And the only way that we can really live beyond lupus is to see from where we came and appreciate that. Understand that we cannot go back to what we used to be. And then make a plan to work beyond the limitations that lupus can bring you. Come out of that depressive state that you can sometimes get into because you have lupus and allow yourself to really live in what you are dealing with today and really understand that how important it is to be in your now. So your midweek refuel is really about just taking the time to see where you were before pre-diagnosis and then going through all of those emotions and then taking note of them, taking note of your limitations and then planning and putting action into making your life better beyond lupus where you are right now. We can't change having lupus, but we can change our response to lupus and we can change what we're doing 
that may create symptoms or that may heighten lupus symptoms, we can change certain things. So we have to start to really focus on the things we can control. And the things that we can control are, you know, really responding to lupus in a different way and not staying in the past as to what you wish you used to be, really operating in your present to know what you can do beyond your limitations. Life can be amazing beyond lupus, but everything that happens from this moment forward is really up to us. And it's up to us whether we want to stay pining for our past or work together in our, in our present to make sure that we're living well beyond lupus and helping ourselves as much as we can so that we can be healthy and wealthy beyond the constraints of lupus. So thank you for always tuning in. Thank you to everyone who has actually signed up to be in our magazine. I will be reaching out to you today. And I hope that you all have a great rest of your week and a great rest of your day. I'll talk to you later. Bye.